Hi guys, today we are going to show you how to prepare a yummy chocolate pecan pie. It's such a nice dessert for the weekends and very easy to prepare. So let's start. Crossed ingredients, plain flour, one and a half cup. Uh, try to put your flour in the fridge to be cooled for 20 minutes at least. Ice cold water, three tablespoons. Butter, 125 grams. Also, your butter has to be cold, so try to put it in the freezer for 10 to 15 minutes. And a pinch of salt. Filling ingredients. Chopped pecan, one cup. Two eggs, lightly beaten. 40 grams of melted butter. Chocolate chips, one cup. You can use bitter chocolate or milky chocolate, whatever you like. Brown sugar, one third cup. One teaspoon of vanilla. And a pinch of salt. Before starting to prepare the crust of the pie, Preheat your oven to 180 degrees of centigrade. At first, we start by preparing the pie crust. In a food processor, put all the cooled uh, flour as well as a pinch of salt and mix them together. Then take the slices of the butter from the freezer and add to the flour and start mixing it as you see in the video. After almost five seconds of mixing, Remove the lid of the food processor and start adding the water by one tablespoon each time and start mixing it with the flour. Do not add the water at once because we might add more than what we need. It might just ruin the dough. So as you see our dough is being prepared. Once the dough just came together, that's the time that you need to stop adding water and you need to remove the dough from the food processor. This is the consistency that we need from our dough. Remove the whole dough from the food processor and make it one whole. Then add it to the plastic bag and keep it for the fridge for about 20 minutes. Now our dough has been in the fridge for about 20 minutes. It is time to prepare the crust now. Sprinkle some flour on the surface where you want to make the crust. And also sprinkle some flour on the top of the dough. And roll out the pastry so that it will be flattened. The size of the crust must be fit the size of the pie pan that you have. So this is completely up to what kind of pie pan you're going to use it. Take the crust carefully and try to place it over the pie pan that you have. And fit it inside the pan. Remove the extra edges and play with the edges to create a beautiful pie edges as you see. Once the crust is ready, just refrigerate it until we need it for the filling. Now to prepare the filling of the pie, add the pecans to the beaten egg, as well as the brown sugar, as well as the melted butter, as well as the vanilla and a pinch of salt. And start mixing it manually until it is completely mixed. To prepare the chocolate of the pie, fill a cooking pot full of water and place it under the high temperature until it's boiling. Keep the temperature too high and place a metal container to be fit on the top of the cooking pot exactly under the boiling water and pour all the chocolates into it. So the chocolates start melting. As you see the chocolates start melting. Once all the chocolates are melted, remove it and add it to the rest of the filling and mix it well. Now bring out the pie crust from the fridge and pour all the filling inside the crust. 
and place it inside the oven and let it bake for about 45 minutes to one hour under 180 centigrade degree. It is almost after one hour now and our pie is totally ready to be out of the oven. Let a pie completely to cool down over the room temperature before slicing it. Now our pie is totally cooled down and it is time to have a bite of this yummy yummy pie. You can have this pie with a scoop of vanilla ice cream and it's a great dessert for holidays. I hope you like this and you make it and enjoy it. Until the next shows, happy cooking!